The army in supporters, heavily armed police officers seal off their own headquarters. Initial reports that four officers had been stabbed to death in the prefecture building sparked fears that the Parisian police had again been targets for a terror attack. But long before the air ambulance left the scene, it was already clear that a different kind of tragedy had resulted in this latest loss of life. Police employees evacuated from the building confirmed the attacker had been one of their own. It happened so fast, this man said. Four of our colleagues were stabbed and then the attacker, another colleague, was shot dead by the police. Confirmation came from Interior Minister Christophe Castanard visiting the scene. This man was well known in the computer department, the minister said. He'd worked alongside his colleagues, never presenting behavioural problems or giving any warning signs. The area around the headquarters, which is close to Notre Dame Cathedral and popular with tourists, was in lockdown for hours as the security services tried to establish a motive. This afternoon, there was a major police operation searching a house in the Gonesse suburb in the northeast of Paris where the attacker had lived. Neighbours said he'd worked for the police for 16 years. His wife has been taken into custody for questioning. Paul Davis, ITV News.